Sasquatch, also called Bigfoot, from Salish Susksak, wild men, a large, hairy, human-like creature believed by some people to exist in the northwestern United States and western Canada. It seems to represent the North American counterpart of the Himalayan region's mythical monster, the Abominable Snowman, or Yeti Alma. Certain remote places would place offerings of food for the creatures out in the open to symbolize the coexisting between us and them. Many other legends speaks of these eight like men, wild men taking women and men alike, but in some instances also protecting them these wild men leave sometimes traces of their visits such as footprints and broken branches and hair that has been pulled off by brushing of the leaves and barks of the trees. These wild men seem primitive but are able to outsmart hunters who are tracking them or hunting them. It is believed that somehow these wild men have much better developed sense than humans, some might be able to read minds and Native Americans have called one special ability of the wild men able to slip walk, which is slide through or create portals and vibrations to vanish or to move through different realms much like fairies and small people of Ireland. Some suspect that the wild men are telepathic. If these rumors are true we are dealing with something far more expansive than just cavemen that diverged from the evolutional path. There have been also reports of these wild men appearing when strange lights in the sky hover over mountains these UFO seem to accompany by the Sasquatch visit to would-be campers and hunters and trackers. The British explorer David Thompson is sometimes credited with the first discovery, 1811, of a set of Sasquatch footprints, and hundreds of alleged prints have been adduced since then. Visual sightings and even alleged photographs and filmings, notably by Roger Patterson at Bluff Creek, California, in 1967, have also contributed to the legend, though none of the purported evidence has been verified. Sasquatch is variably described as a primate ranging from 6 to 15 feet, 2 to 4.5 meters, tall, standing erect on two feet, often giving off a foul smell, and either moving silently or emitting a high-pitched cry. Footprints have measured up to 24 inches, 60 centimeters, in length and 8 inches, 20 centimeters, in width. A Soviet scientist, Boris Porshnev, suggested that Sasquatch and his Siberian counterpart, the Almas, could be a remnant of Neanderthals, but most scientists do not recognize the creature's existence. Patterson-Gimlin film, also known as the Patterson film or the PGF, is a short motion picture of an unidentified subject which the filmmakers have said was a Sasquatch. The footage was shot on October 20, 1967 in Northern California, and has since been subjected to many attempts to debunk it. The Bluff Creek Project is an open-source volunteer project, initially formed to locate the original Patterson-Gimlin Bigfoot film site. It consists of several project contributors, who volunteered their time and gas money, to complete the mountains of field work, needed to confirm the site's location. They have been researching the area formally on foot since 2009. Few creatures have more speculation and anecdotal evidence surrounding them than Sasquatch does. Before the 19th century, when stories about the mysterious ape man began circulating in the American West, most Native American tribes had their own legends surrounding the enigmatic creature. Sasquatch, most commonly spotted in the Pacific Northwest, is usually described as a bipedal ape-like creature, significantly larger than the average man, and completely covered in dark brown or reddish hair. Although the scientific community remains skeptical and little evidence exists in support of a modern-day Bigfoot, there are a lot of people out there who are confident that some sort of ape-man roams through the depths of North America's most remote forests and devote their lives to finding them. Legend of Bigfoot Many nations have their stories of encountering these tall big hair ape-like creatures with human features. The legends of Bigfoot go back beyond recorded history and cover the world. In North America and particularly the Northwest, you can hear tales of seven-foot-tall hairy men stalking the woods, occasionally scaring campers, lumberjacks, hikers and the like. Bigfoot is known by many titles with many different cultures, although the name Bigfoot is generally attributed to the mountainous western region of North America. The common name Sasquatch comes from the Salish Sasquits, while the Algonquin of the north-central region of the continent refer to a Wittico or Windigo. Other nations tell of a large creature, much like a man but imbued with special powers and characteristics. The Ojibwe of the Northern Plains believed the Ruguru appeared in times of danger, and other nations agreed that the hairy apparition was a messenger of warning, telling men to change his ways. North American settlers started reporting sightings during the late 1800s and into the 1900s with the occasional finding of footprints, sporadic encounters and even a few grainy photos and videos adding to the mystery. 
Those who claim to have seen Bigfoot have described everything from a large, upright ape to an actual hairy human, sometimes standing over eight feet tall and described as powerfully built. The debate and research continue. Entire organizations exist to study and document Bigfoot and prove its existence and groups regularly search the Northwest Woods, looking for that ultimate proof. In one very real sense, however, Bigfoot does exist. The Western Air Defense Sector, Washington Air National Guard adopted the mascot of Bigfoot and operates 24 hours a day, 7 days a week monitoring the skies of nearly 73% of the United States and Canada. Just like the Bigfoot of legend, the sector is rarely seen and rarely heard but rest assured it continues to observe and, if necessary, serve as a messenger of warning. Sometimes accompanied by orbs and strange lights on the mountains the sounds you are about to hear are recording believed to be Bigfoot they are highly territorial, and would often vocal warning sounds from on approachers, they have been known to rip trees and thrown it at people also boulders.